Hello everybody, welcome back to JTP, and today's video I'm going to be reviewing um, the 2022 midterms in Arizona and why I do think Carrie Lake will win the governor's race and Blake Masters will win the Senate race. And um, before we get started, please like and subscribe if you think this video and channel deserves a rating. And uh, make sure you check out my other videos, so yeah. Um, so I made a video about Air, I'm sorry, Pennsylvania. And I do think how that will be a tilt, and it can even be a lean bass, and I do think it will be a tilt. But you can get to that video um, in my channel. But right now, we're talking about Arizona. So I'll first start with the Senate race, um, or Governor's race, and then we'll um, go to the Senate race. So in the Governor's race, I believe, yeah, this was the one. Carrie Lake, if I could say, is gaining a momentum. She is now in the lead in recent polls, plus four, plus four. Trafalgar and Data for Progress, and this is actually pretty sure um, sponsored by Democrat says D on it. I don't know if D, uh, but either I'm not I'm not sure if that's true. But either way, Carrie Lake is up in these polls, and usually Republicans should be ahead. I mean, sorry, Democrats usually should be ahead right now. If I can't pull that up over here, Mark Kelly was up right now in this moment of time by like six points or so. And right now, Carrie Lake's already winning right now. And um, if you didn't know, uh, let me get to the governor's primaries. Um, she defeated Karen Taylor Robson and won every single county. And um, the vote tally was more than Democrats, of course. And um, a Democrat Katie Hobbs. Um, is not going to um, debate Carrie Lake, which is awful that she said that. And I do think Carrie Lake will probably win the state with a lead margin, so I'll point you that. Um, I do think she will very well easy do this, easy win this state, probably expanding her lead as um, the time comes more to the midterms. Um, so now with uh, the Senate race, our Trafalgar poll, um, let me find the Arizona poll. Uh oh. Uh, I don't think it's going to load or it might take some time, so let me just go over here. So, right now, Blake Masters is going up. And if you look at the recent polling, it's going a lot closer. And there was a poll that had Kelly plus and that can just be like all these polls over here. Like, I mean, Kelly's up with like a, a t you know, like plus, uh, plus 20. Um, and <laughs> since the time, Mark Kelly, um, should be in the lead with big, big margins. Um, and I do think Masters is getting momentum, and actually, um, let me show that graph again. Um, uh, Mark Kelly should be in the lead as of right now with, like, maybe eight points or so, seven. And right now, if we disclude that eight, that, um, a vote plus eight Kelly, that'll be much lower than six points and I wouldn't really you know take this pool good I mean even if it was good it could be um Kelly still doesn't have that much and considering it's gonna be a red wave year at least how I think it and with the other races I do think Masters of maybe defeat Mark Kelly it's probably gonna be tough but I do think Black Blake Masters will pull out the victory at the end of the day. Republicans usually start surging. Let me just try to pull that up. Um, they usually start to go up as the midterms come. Uh, so yeah, I do think this is one of the, oh, probably maybe one of the reasons why that Mark Kelly, I'm sorry, Blake Masters and uh, Carrie Lake will win Arizona. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or whatever, um, please tell me in the comments. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.